Mitch, congratulations. You had an incredible third lap uh, that made your first 100 look quite easy, was it? Yeah, I, uh, I made a few mistakes early in this year swimming the 200. I, I tried to win it and, uh, you know, swim as fast as I can in the first 50 and I paid for it sort of that second and, and that third 50. So tonight I went in with a bit more control and, and really tried to work the second 100 and, and hopefully it paid off. <laughs> Did you expect this time? Uh, no, I... I honestly thought I could swim 154 low, uh, maybe scrape under 154, but uh, to do that I was, I was, I was um, amazed. Which one do you prefer, the 100 or the 200 now? <laughs> That's a tough question, they're very different. Uh, like I said, the 200 is a lot about more control and, and sort of you know, pacing the race correctly, whereas the 100 is about skills and, and really just going for it. So they're very different and, and they're both fantastic races. Why has changed in the past, I don't know, one or two years that made you world champion short course and now long course uh, I don't know I, I've learned a few few lessons along the way uh, certainly developed as a swimmer and, and learned to uh, I guess not get caught up in the hype of these big meets um, you know out there there's a lot of lights big sounds and it can get quite distracting but uh, you know this week I've really taken it in and enjoyed it